Hello. Welcome back. I'm Captain Mal, and we're about to go into some furious combat. Furious combat! Pick up right where we left off. Evidently, the Spanish have had it with us, and they have sent yet another pirate hunter. Now, bear in mind, we have no backup for the fuzzy bear. Nope, none at all. We can't very well fight in one of these merchantmen, so we have got to make this happen. Let's do it! I'll tell you what, I am pretty sure I'm going to try to keep my distance and put that big bad boy down, having never set a foot on its hull, or on its deck. That'd make more sense, right? The wind is not with us, so that is making things very difficult. It's like the worst possible wind conditions for us, and very favorable for his ship class. So we're going to have to change things up a little bit. Close in more than I wanted to. But well, we kind of... Kind of put a hurtin' on his guns and stuff, so that's good. Oh, I did not want to do that. Hmm. I'm tempted to go longsword this time. Nah, we're sticking with the rapier. Come on, come on. Alright, alright. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. I want to hold on to this fuzzy bear. I don't, I, that sounded funny. I want to hold on to my fuzzy bear. Uh, I want to keep the ship we have. There we go. Now what is that thing? A fast guy? Eh, screw it. Sinker. Whew, okay. And, uh, uh, you know what? We're just actually gonna sail away from that guy. I'm not necessarily afraid of him per se, but I'm, I'm not gonna go attack that town because it only has its poor, right? So I don't need to attack it. And here's a trade galleon right here. It's gonna put up basically no resistance and give us gold. So seems like a better deal to me. And that should disarm him. Oh, almost. How about this one? There we go. All right. Run up your colors. Yeah, that's what I thought. Sinker, take everything. Thank you. Thank you for your contribution. All right, now let's look at the map here. Where are we going hunting? We're here. I think we should just, like, go for everything on this island, basically. Yep. Really? You're still following us? Okay. Well, I've got winds at my back, so we'll see how this works out for you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, you're not gonna hit. You're not gonna hit. Oh, ho, ho. sucks to be you. Okay, now, now that you can't run, see, I can make repairs at sea, right? He can't. So, after we're done with this fight, I'll still be okay, mostly. And he is never making it off that ship. Get in a little closer. We'll go for a full broadside. And no, 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 no. And yes. Mm -hmm. How you like that? What are you thinking? Good or bad idea for you to follow me across the whole ocean, pal? Thinking you're regretting that decision now. 
Surrendered? Oh, I can't even remember that ever happening. Pirate Hunter surrendering? <laughs> nice. And another... <sighs> We're, we're out in the middle of nowhere. It's just, that's, that's just ridiculous. All right, I'm I'm ignoring that. Seriously. All right, where's... Oh, Sentinel goes down there. All right, so let... Ah! Turn, 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 turn. I don't want the ships to... Come on. Come on. Oh. All right. Okay, I guess I'll have to do it again. Problem is, I'm gonna have to go back to port at some point. I'm not gonna have, a, I'm not gonna have a choice. Oh, did not want to have to do this fight because you know, like we've had in other parts, sometimes you get the 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 crazy one, right? Where he's like super crazy fast. No, no, no. Jump, not jump. If this guy's not fast, I'm just making mistakes. There we go. Um, should we keep her? Uh, she's got upgrades. Yeah, actually we should keep her. Sleep of War? That's a, that's a great upgrade. Or, not, not upgrade, but backup. Okay, I want to go... Oh, no, no, no. Not land. Okay, let's go over here. What do we got? That looks like it's... Modest. Mm. I don't know that that's really worth attacking. We can take this ship, though. Let's go for the fast galleon first. I'm not sure why it's not hitting the fast galleon. Okay, let's see if we can pull away, fire again. No, 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 no. no. I want to be in a broadside situation with this guy. Whew, that could have been bad. Our broadside to him? Sure. His to us? No. Sales. It's good. So let's turn after him. And what are we going to do here? I guess we're going to have to board him. Yep. Should be okay. It's just an escort ship. Nothing too fancy. I say that as I get chased back up the stairs. I spoke too soon. There we go. Get your butt down the stairs. Come on, come on. I think we're okay. We're, just... we're gonna need some repairs though after this. So we'll need to take that town, turn it into a friendly town, and then get repairs. <laughs> Which 
is what we're gonna do. Coincidentally. There we go. Uh, tree Galleon. Uh, I think we'll take everything and just sink her, right? We have space? Oh, uh, we don't have space. Well, whatever. We're still gonna sink her. Screw it. Well, eh, uh, we'll keep it. We could just turn around and sell it, right? So, who cares? Yep. Now, we're gonna take this place, not because it's necessarily optimal, but it's worth taking it just for strategic value, I guess. Change start location. Alright, start here. This works. up here. You know what? I'm gonna move back. Probably gonna lose these officers, actually. I didn't realize they were so close. I oh, know. We'll be okay. We'll be alright. We'll beat those scouts. Or we should. Is this a flank right here? It is. All right. So I had another unit position there. Okay, we'll move forward. We will move forward. Really, I don't have a shot right here? It seems strange. the officers most likely right yeah looks like it but that's okay we're all right we're actually in decent shape right now let's put the grid on um, let's, yeah let's fire on those guys thin them out a little bit shall we Let's do the same thing here. Nice. Okay. And... Let's go like this. And like this. And then we can go here next turn, and then the following turn we'd be able to flank if we need to, right? Mm-hmm. Can go up and over. Is that their last unit? It seemed like they had more people than that. I guess not. You know what though? I'm gonna play it safe and go in here to save my guys. And we're gonna come out here. We'll attack like this. Alright. We won't get much gold from this, I don't think. Oh, I was wrong? Okay. 10,000 gold, you don't say. Wow. Um, I guess we'll go with... Oh, we're still trying to build English, right? Because we already have... Yep, yeah, so we'll... Okay, so here's an example, right? 
I am going to choose English Lord. So even though this action itself did not give me any bonus, any faction bonus with the English, because they're not at war with the Spanish right now, this will give me a, a, a bonus because I'm going to install an English governor. Who we're going to go talk to right now. Who won't know that I put him here? <laughs> well, you installed an English governor. Yes. Yes, thank you. Someday you'll be promoted. All right. Oh, he has a beautiful daughter. Oh, well, actually, don't mind if I do accept your invitation. What can I say, guys? I like the gingers. <laughs> the redheads do it for me. Okay, so far so good. Can I keep it up? Oh, uh, no, evidently not. Okay, okay. I don't know why this is such a pain for me, but it is. Am I getting close to the end? Come on. Oh, I think so. I don't know. I don't know. So to see how the heart thing's all like pounding and what have you, that means she's, oh, darn it. Well, screwed it up. Yeah, that screwed it up. Too many mistakes. So it'll start the romance with her, but she's not going to give me an item or anything. Uh, great value at the moment he's traveling to Santiago on a fast gallon. Oh, okay. At least she gave me some good info. So now when I go check status, then I go to personal status. Now I have, see, her at 3 out of 10 romance. Um, you know, beautiful. So I need to get a, I need to basically dance with her again and or and then she'll tell me about her fiance and well you, you guys will see, but there's like a whole thing. It's not just it's not exactly easy, but it ends you end up getting getting married if you get 10 out of 10 on the romance. and that's important towards your um, your end game score. All right? So we're definitely this is where we're gonna be coming. We're, we're gonna stick with her. Okay, let's check our status. Crew's very happy. Let's see if there's anybody who wants to join. 58. Nice. Help you trade with merchants in enemy cities. Yeah, I will take that, actually. Sales out of... Ah! Where's he at? Right there, huh? It's not much gold, but... Let's head to Santiago, huh? Alright, we'll head over there. Since we're gonna go try to take out some more towns anyway. Trade with merchant. I really don't need food. But I don't really want to sell it at three gold per. Having said that, uh, you know what? We can dump some of it. Pick up something more valuable. Okay, let's get some repairs. Uh, do we need to keep this thing? No, we don't. Good. Okay. All right. We're in good shape. Very happy. 420 guys. All right. Not the 500 we had, but... It'll do. Now the question is... Do we go back and try to get more people? I don't really want to sail that way. 
let's go see let's go see what this town has to offer this French town like if he's if he if it is worth trying to take Modest French port. No, nope, I don't want to do modest French port. Well, let's go around, because if we're going to attack something and lose a ton of our crew, then let's lose it going after something big, right? Hey, I can go check out this pirate place right here. Okay, now that Indian war canoe uh, is that, it might be headed to raid that town that we were just looking at. If it does, that changes things, because it'll weaken its defenses and it'll be worth it. So I will hold on to see if that's where it's going. Come on, are you? Is that where you're going? Eh, maybe not. All right. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, it did. It did raid it. Okay. There's a tavern. Twenty-five men. Uh, no, I don't need that. Yeah, Bart Roberts, that's fine. Okay, I do want to go get the guy that knows information about my family, so we will do that. Let's hold the ship right. Nope, nothing I need. Trade the merchant. No. Well, I can sell a little bit more food. Defeated. Okay, so see, they were defeated, but still, it's probably worth it to go for that. So let's let's do just that. We will set down right here. No, no, no. I don't. Oh, there's a tavern. Oh, it's just a settlement, though. Let's hold the ship right. Got anything here? No, okay, sail away. I just want to set down. Like, right here. Yes, anchor here. Uh-huh. We'll see how many soldiers it is. If it's significantly less than us, we're gonna do it. Oh, 100 soldiers? Yeah, you're about to get your ass kicked. Now, in the... I guess it doesn't do it anymore, or maybe it never did it in this version. In the original game, if you had, like, a ton more soldiers, like, in that situation, you would just immediately get, uh... You'd immediately go over the walls of the fort and into the town, like, straight in. And you'd have a, a sword fighting thing, but that's it. That'd be the extent of it. So, I'm not sure if it just doesn't do that in, the, in this version, and I'm forgetting, or... It could be. Let's see. Uh, let's turn Grid on. I don't need to take unnecessary damage, because he's going to come out one, and then he could fire. So, we're actually going to skip turn. Yep. Move the Buccaneers up. These pirates... Can go up here. And actually just hang out back here. I think I'm gonna do this mostly with Buccaneers if I can. Yeah, or for that matter, these officers can take these guys out right now. That's easy enough. I'll take a little damage from these guys, but meh. Uh, let's see, if I move here, do I get a shot? No? Really? Hmm. Alright. Next unit. I know, it seems like I'm being overly careful. I just, I don't want to waste the, the sailors that I have, right? Because the crew's actually happy right now, and... I'd like to hold, you know, hold on to him so I can attack as many settlements as I can with the big crew. I can't do that if 
if I lose too many of them, right? Because it's too hard to replace them out here. I mean, I can replace a handful of them at, some, at, at the few friendly places, ports of coal that I have, but again, there's not a ton of them. But this was too this was too much too good to pass up. Four or five to one odds, yeah. So two thousand gold, eh? Give or take that. But we should get the town. There we go. Okay, so we are gonna make this. Yep, you guessed it, English, because we want to get a promotion. Now, will we get it? I don't know. We'll find out in the next one. <laughs> All right. So I hope you liked this one. And if you did, please consider giving me a thumbs up. As always, I appreciate your comments and feedback. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, I'm Captain Mal, and I will see you later. Oh, Governor. Governor.